All right, so we've been practicing our uchikomis, and we've been practicing forward and back, and we're practicing to the side, okay? So now, you know, and you know when we do judo, we don't always go forward and back and to the side, or just to the diagonal. A lot of times when we're working out, we go circles, right? We circle left, or we circle right, okay? So we're gonna practice our uchikomis that way. So we're facing our partner, we got our grip, we're going to circle to our left, starting with your left foot, left, right, okay? So if your partner is standing in front of you, so if your partner is standing in front of you, you're going to try to step to their side, so you're facing them from the side, okay? You're just making a circle from in front to the side, okay? That would be circle left, your left foot first, circle to the right, right foot first, okay? So only two steps, just Left, right, left, right, come back, right, left, right, left. And you always want to face your partner from the side, okay? So when that happens, usually your partner follows you a little bit, right? So if I circle around, one, two, my partner follows me around a little bit. Now from here, I can attack, okay? So we're going to practice what you call me with those steps in mind. So we're going to go. Circle left, one, two, what you call me? Okay, reset, circle right, one, two, attack, left side, left side. Okay, so we're gonna alternate, circle, start with the left foot, right foot, circle, attack, right side. Okay, reset, start with the right foot, right, left, circle, attack, left, left side. Okay, does that make sense? So we don't keep going around in circle, 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 we'll get dizzy. So. Always just think, circle to the side and attack and reset. Circle the other side and attack. Okay, so when you're attacking, you're always turning towards the same direction. All right, if that makes it easier, you're turning towards the camera. You want to throw towards the camera or towards the TV. Okay, so we'll start nice and easy with serenagas. All right, you can do Marote serenagas or Ipon serenagas. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Mainly, we're trying to get the circle motion. Okay, so we're here. Circle left, one, two, and attack. All right. So when we circle left, we start with our left foot, left, right. And now we attack right, left. Come to our toe. All right. We come back, reset. Circle with our right foot first, one, two. Now we attack left foot first, one, two. Okay, make sense. All right, we'll try it. We'll go nice and slow. All right, see where you're now. Rotate, see where you're now. Or you can see where you're now. Sorry, go circle left. Ready? Circle one, two. Attack right foot, left foot. One. All right. Good. Right foot first. Ready? One, two. Circle. Attack left. Good. Reset. Good. Circle one, two. Attack. Three, four. Reset. Good. Nice. Circle with right foot. One, two. Attack left foot. Three, four. Good. All right. Left foot. One, two. Right foot. Three, four. Good. Right foot first. One, two. Circle. Left foot. The ten. Good. Ready? Left foot. One, two. Three, four. Good. Right foot. Ready? One, two. Left foot. Three, four. All right. Good job. Good job. Same thing we're going to do with. Ogoshi, Ogoshi, where you reach underneath the belt, grab the belt, okay? So we're gonna circle left, grab the belt, go right. All right, ready? Start with the left foot, Ogoshi, ready? Circle, one, two, grab the belt, three, four. Left. left side, right foot first, one, two, left foot, left hand, three, four. Yeah. Good. All right, left foot, one, two, grab, three, four. Good. Right foot. One, two, three, four. Four. Ready? Left foot. One, two, three, four. Five. Good. Right foot first. One, two, three, four. Six. Good. Left foot first. One, two, three, four. Seven. Good. Right foot first. One, two, three, four. Eight. Good job. All right. All right. Same thing, Koshigunama. Koshigunama, round the head. 
Okay. All right, hands up. Start with the left foot. Circle left. One, two. Push your good Three, four. One. Good. All right. Right foot. One, two. Three, four. Good. Good. Make sure you take nice sharp steps too. Make sure you move both feet. One, two. Okay. Don't get lazy. Don't just do one and get lazy with that second step. Because if you do that during run duty, it's not going to work. All right. So you have to make two sharp steps. All right. Let's go again. Left foot first. Ready. One, two, three, four. Good. Much better. Right foot. Ready. One, two, three, four. Better. Make them better. Ready. Left foot. One, two, three, four. Five. Good. Right foot first. One, two, three, four. Six. Good. You get a little hop in your feet. Ready? One, two, three, four. Seven. Last one. Coach, you're going to one. Right foot. One, two, three, four. Eight. Good job. Nice. All right. We're going to change it a little bit. We're going to go to Ashwaza, leg technique. Same idea. We're going to circle and come back Ochigari. Okay? So we circle with our left foot around, bring our partners around, and Ochigari in the same direction. Okay? Same, buddy. <laughs> so if you have your partner, you circle around and he follows you there. Okay? So before he can set down, you're throwing. Right? One, two. Okay? So you got to get used to circle and hook. Okay? Then we come back. Circle left and hook. Okay? Does that make sense? So we circle with our left foot first. One and quick right hook. And we come back. We circle right and left hook. Left hook, you guys. All right? Make sense? Let's try it. All right. Start with our left leg. Circle up to the left. Go right side of Uchigai. Ready? One and two. And back. Ready? Right foot and two. Good. good. Looking good. Left foot. One, two. Three. And right foot. One, two. Four. Nice. Looking good. Left foot. One, two. Back. Right foot. One, two. Six. All right, left foot, ready, one, two, seven, and right foot, one, two, eight. All right, good, good. Let's do the same thing with Kochi Gai, okay? So it's gonna be the opposite though. So if we circle with our left foot, we're circling with our left foot, we're gonna throw with our left foot. All right, Kochi Gai is opposite. You circle with your right foot, Throw your right foot. All right, so it's three steps. One, two, three, and back. All right, one, two, three. Okay, does that make sense? Three step, coach you guys. Okay, so we'll start with our right foot this time. One, two, three. So we're doing right side, coach you guys, because mostly everyone's right handed. Okay, so we'll start with that. Start with your right foot, circle into your right. Ready? Three, one, two, three, and back. Left foot, one, two, three. Good. Good, and back. Right foot, one, two, three. And back. Left foot, one, two, three. Four. And back. Right foot, one, two, three. Five. And back. Left foot, one, two, three. Six. And back. Right foot, one, two, three. Seven. Back. Left foot, one, two, three. Hey. And back. Good job. Good job. Uh, wait, last one. Oh, okay. So let's do all Sobagadi. All right. We're going to step in one, two, three. Actually, circle, circle, and throw all Sobagadi. Okay. So we're going to circle with the left foot, circle, and come in all Sobagadi. Okay. So circle left, one, two, and throw. Reset. Circle with the right foot, one, two, throw with your left foot. Okay? Circling, all side of guard. All right, ready, hands up. Start with your left foot. Ready, circle, one, two, and three, four. Good, back. All right, right foot, one, two, and throw. Good. All right, left foot, 
circle, one, two, and throw. Good. Circle, right foot. One, two, throw left. Good. All right. Left foot. One, two, and throw. Five. Good. Right foot. One, two, and throw. Six. Good. Left foot. One, two, and throw. Seven. Good. Circle right foot. One, two, and throw. Eight. Eight. All right. All right. Good. Okay. Let's switch this. So for all you guys that have done kata, nagino kata before, this is, should be easy for you. This is a setup for uchimata and nagino kata, right? We circle one, two, three, and through uchimata, right? We're just gonna cut it down to one step. So circle and throw. All right, so with left foot, circle to the left, pull your front around, throw uchimata, okay? Then we'll practice the left side. So with your right foot, Circle, pull your foot around, throw with your left leg. All right? So right side, left side, right side, left side. All right, let's try it. Let's get an idea of circles. Great, hands up. Starting with your left foot, circle left, one, two, and uchimata. Good. Make sure when you do uchimata, your support leg, get a little bend. Hard to do uchimata when your leg is straight, you're gonna fall all over, right? So you bend your knee, you have a little spring. Okay. All right, let's start again. Right side. Ready? Circle with your left foot. One, two, and throw. Good. All right, right foot first. Ready? One, two, and throw. Good. Nice. Left foot. Ready? One, two, throw. Good job. Right foot first. One, two, and throw. Nice. All right. Left foot. One, two, throw. Five. Good. Right foot. Ready? One, two, and throw. Six. Good. Left foot. One, two, and throw. Seven. All right. Right foot. One, two, and throw. Eight. Eight. All right. Very nice. Very nice. Last one. Same idea, same circle, but instead of Uchimata, we'll do Haraigoshi. Oh, okay, everyone knows Haraigoshi? <laughs> Haraigoshi, we're sweeping on the outside. Uchimata, we sweep in the inside. Okay. All right, so we're going to circle the same way. We're going to circle around and throw. <laughs> All right. All right, Haraigoshi, last set, eight times. Hands up. Start with our left foot. Ready? Circle. One, two, and throw. Good. Right foot. One, two, and throw. Good. Left foot. One, two, throw. Right foot. One, two, and throw. Good. Left foot. One, two, throw. Five. And right foot. One, two, throw. And left foot. One, two, throw. And right foot. One, two, throw. Eight. Eight. All right. Nice and done. Nice and done. Good job. So, as you guys know, judo isn't always about moving forward, back, side to side. We always do judo in circles. And a lot of times, we do it in a combination of directions. We'll start sideways, and then you can turn it into a circle. You can go forward, turn that into a circle. You can move back, turn that into a circle, okay? So don't think it's only one dimensional. You can combine these movements, all different directions. The more combinations and more different directions you can do your throw, it can be the same throw, but by moving in a different direction, your throw becomes much more uh, deceiving, okay? Uh, it could be the same throw, but it looks like you're doing a different throw, just with a different setup, all right? So good. I'll uh, take a water break, and we're gonna come back with Society to the Komiyashi, all right? Go get some water. Oh yeah. That makes sense. Good, yeah. Good. Propping throw. Basically, it's a trip. 
you're tripping up part, your partner's foot, so you can't take the step. Cool. One way to do this, and not gonna pop it up, right? We're taking three steps. One, two and a half, and three. Okay? And before they can take that full third step, we block the ankle, okay? With the side of your foot, the bottom side of your foot, okay? Not this side of your foot. Turn your foot sideways so you hit them with the bottom of your foot, all right? Otherwise, you're gonna hit them in the shin and they're not gonna like it too much, all right? So when you, when you block them, Block them right at the ankle, right, just above the foot, okay? All right, block the ankle. And a lot of times you'll hear a little bit of a, a tap, a little tap at the bottom of your foot, okay? All right, so your hands going straight, okay? Your partner comes straight by you, all right? So as we're walking back, from here, turn, fall forward, and keep it going forward, all right? So. <laughs> And basic Sasai Tsuru Komiyashi. If I ask you to do Sasai Tsuru Komiyashi on your test for your promotion, basic Sasai Tsuru Komiyashi, just like Ashi, uh, De Ashikurai, the hand you have the sleeve, that's the side you want to demonstrate for your test. Okay? But when we do Randori or Shiai, we also do Sasai Tsuru Komiyashi off of the lapel hand, too. Okay? So you can do it either side. Okay, the only downside to doing it off of the lapel is this hand is free. So even if I throw him, he can put his hand down and stop himself from falling on his back. Okay, if he's fast enough. Okay, here, and he can put his hand up. All right, so if you do it properly, he won't have a chance, but he has an option. If you have the sleeve, he can't do that. All right, so the basic way is with the sleeve. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if you're walking towards you, walking back towards you, you turn to the side, just like we did before, the little circle motion to the side, so I'm facing the side, and I keep him going straight forward, and I block him right in front of me, okay? I don't have to stop him way back there, because when I try to block his foot way back there, I'm off, off balance, okay? It's not a foot sleep, I'm not sleeping, I'm just blocking, okay? So, as he's walking forward here, stop it right here in front of him. I don't have to go way back here, try to stop his foot way back there and try to throw him this way. It's pretty difficult to do. All right. So, as we're walking, I can stop him right there, right in front of him, and boom, they pop. Okay. That's basic society command. All right. Um, on the other side, it's the same thing with the lapel hand. Turn to the side. And pull. I like to do it with the lapel side because with the lapel, you got much more control of your partner's body. Okay, he can put his hand down, but when you pull somebody with the lapel, it's so much stronger. You get much more control. You get much more dynamic throw. Okay, but just remember, the sleeve hand is a proper basic side. Okay, that's the side to Komiyashi. Okay, and you can do this in circles. Okay, you can do it going backwards. You can do it going forward, which is a little bit harder. Okay. And you can do it in circle. Circle. Okay. So, Megumi, you want to demonstrate? Yeah. Your side? Okay. So, Megumi will show you her side. Okay. Okay. Do you guys see that? Please say you saw. <laughs> so she's doing it. <laughs> right, EW. <laughs> 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 All right. Okay, so Megumi's doing hers moving forward. Yeah. All right. On that last step, she steps to the outside of the park. Uh -huh. So we're walking here. Outside. Yeah. 
She steps to the outside, but also she's getting very close. She's closing the gap. There's no space. There's no space between our bodies. <laughs> hand, hand, yeah, like a handle, handle, okay? Yes, yes, yes. Big, like a big steering wheel. Yeah. Like, like steering wheel. Yeah. Big steering wheel. Yes. Good, good. 180 degree. Yes. Yeah. So she turns her body all the way around, 180 degrees, opposite direction. All right, yeah. Yes. All right, yeah, good, good. Let's see. All right. Yeah. Okay, shadow chikomis. One, two, three. Okay. All right, shadow chikomis. Okay, so watch your, watch your steps carefully. All right, watch your steps carefully. Come on. Okay, righty. I'm a righty. Okay, fast righty. So right, right leg. Fast. One, two, two step is a big step. Second step. Second step is a big step. Big step. Uh, Right? One, two, three. With um, hand. Yeah. Handle. Handle. Oh, steering. 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 Yeah. OK? Um, and uh, eight times. Eight times. Hands up. One, two, three. Good. One. One, two, three. Demonstrate, Megumi will demonstrate a combination with her society to Komayashi. Okay? So. Okay. So, Megumi has many combinations of the society to Komayashi. Show you. Okay? Ah, fast! At first, Sasae Ostogari. Second, Sasae Uchimata. 
sad, sasae, ipondeoi. Right? Okay. Show you. Can you see that? Please say yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're going to explain the Osogai. Yes. That's the first one. First one. First one. Mm -hmm. first one. Sasae Osogai. Sasae. One, two. Sasae. One, two. Awesome. Yes. Keeping. Left, left, right, left. Right. Second combination, Sasae to Komayashi to Uchimata. Masi, you should watch this, right? This is your favorite throw, Uchimata. Pay attention. Don't make me fall too many times.
good. Good job. Mats, you got that? Mats, you get that? Yes? We'll practice more when we get back. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, okay. Last one. Combination society to Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay, everything's off the lapel grip. Okay, so pay attention to that. Otherwise, you get confused. Okay, one, two, three, and three. Spinning, spinning, spinning. Three, two, three. One, two, one, two. Do you remember spinning? Say it again. One, two. Okay. Right. Hands up. One, two, three, four. Okay, good, good. One, two, three, four. Strong. Okay. Good. Questions about society, society Komiyashi, or the combination techniques? I mean, there's many, many more that you can think of that you can work together to, but you just got to keep practicing. Okay? All right. Uh, we're going to move on to uh, Hiza Guruma. Hiza Guruma, knee wheel. Okay? Knee wheel. All right. Very, very similar to Sasai. Okay? Very similar. Same motions with the hands. Foot position is a little bit different. So, on Sasai, Sasai to come out here, we, we block the ankle, okay? Kiza Guruma, we're blocking the knee, okay? Blocking the knee, all right? Because it's knee wheel, all right? You're not kicking the knee, don't kick the knee, it's a block the knee, okay? So, you're pulling your heart forward, but you're stopping your leg from coming forward by blocking the knee, all right? It's not a sweep. You don't sweep into the knee because you'll hurt somebody. You block it. Okay? Does that make sense? Okay? So, if you're here, right? You, you, if your partner brought them back here, you step to the side, block the knee. Okay? Boom, block the knee. And it's the same motion as the side to come out. But now, the difference is the spacing is a little bit different. Okay, because as a society, you're blocking way down by the ankle, you can be a little bit closer. Okay, with Hiza Guruma, because you're blocking up higher here, you can be a little bit farther away, you can have a little more room. Okay, so it's a little bit different. Right, oh, depends on which way you're going, too. I'm sorry. If you're walking forward, your partner walks forward, you probably need a little more space. Okay, if you're walking into your partner, your partner's walking backwards. So you're going to here, you might want to get a little bit closer when that foot goes back. There. Now you want to back up. Okay, so it's a little, a little bit different. All right, but the, the similar knee position, same to the sheet. All right, the spacing changes a little bit. So, can you give me a demonstration sheet here? He's a good one? Yeah. 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 Okay, can you give me a little show you her? He's a good one. Okay, again, oh, same thing applies. <coughs> 
basic he's a good one the sleeve hand that's the one you apply he's a good one on your test that's basic but and run dirty you can go both sides off the same grip okay So, so she has a very nice setup for he for his aguruma, right? She touches it, the knee, and then she hops into it. Okay, so she's got a little extra hop that gives her a lot more torque on the throw. Okay, so there's a, it's kind of a two-step his aguruma, but it's very very effective. Okay. All right, so usually when you do Hiza Guruma, right, you're doing one, two, right? Okay, one, two. She's going one, touch first, then hop. Right? A little bit different, it's a little bit different. So pay, pay attention again. Yeah. One, one touch, and keeping my body. So two, hop, hop the same. Hop with hand, okay? One, only touch. One, one, two. <laughs> yes. <laughs> one, two. One is there. I think you're not really thinking about it. One, one, two, one. We just don't make it. That is not. Ah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> kind of a fake. Yeah. Fake. So the first step when she touches, it's kind of a fake. All right, it's a sell. It's a fake. Okay. All right. She sets you up. So you really don't know what's going on. All of a sudden you you have foot on your knee, you're kind of you freeze a little bit. Okay. Then she hops into it. Yes. Okay. Okay. Well, quiet. Soft about two big big ball. Okay. One. on that a little bit different he's a guru mom, but it's a pretty effective one okay yes yes okay okay uh do you, do you have a combination going on? <laughs> maybe to come back with the yeah, actual right uh, maybe i don't know <laughs> okay um so some some other combinations Okay, so I, I like to do some combinations, mostly with Sasai. I don't do Hiza Guruma very often, but some of the combinations from Sasai, adding on to what uh, Megumi was doing. Uh, I like to do Sasai to Komiyashi, same thing off of the lapel grip because that's side stronger. And a lot of times when you do Sasai, you don't get the throw, but you get them off balance and they, they come back. <laughs> So you do your society and you stand up just like that. They come back around, they stand back up. I like to follow it up with the Ashbara. Okay? Try to get the same timing, right? So society, yes. the right? So you make it a circle and a wave, right? Circle and wave. Alright? If you got a partner that moves with you, this technique works. But if you get someone who doesn't move very well, it, it, it's hard to do. But if you get someone that you can get moving around. This technique will work. Right? You do this side, and you follow it up, get that timing, and you follow up with the Ashibara. Okay, so it's a nice, easy circle, same side step, one, two, step, 
three, four. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Okay, you gonna try that? Okay, let's try it. Ready up? Three times. Four times. Three times. Three times. <laughs> okay. Are we ready? Do your regular exercise step and exercise step and sweep. All right. So we're working on circles. Ready? One, two, three, four. All right. Again. Ready? One, two, three, four. Good. Nice big circles. Ready? One, two, three, four. Three. All right. Very good. Good. And uh, one more combination that I've been working on. I do a lot now because everybody knows I do yoga with Moenage, so they always stop me. All right, it's hard to get them off balance. You can't hear. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So when I come in yoga with Moenage, I mean regular yoga with Moenage, everybody tends to sit on their butt, so it's hard to get someone in here. I end up doing this. Okay. So what I've been doing a lot now is I set my partner up with this aside right here. Seeds on his toes, that's what I want right there. Once they're on their toes, I can do my two when I do. So here and here. <laughs> okay. Get up, come on, get up, get up. So once you get your partner up on your toes like this, you drop right in for a yoke with my knife. It's pretty easy. Kind of hard to do it with your if you don't have a mat at home. So uh, if you do have a mat, you can try it. If you don't, be careful when you sit down. It might hurt your back. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to do so side. So I do the, uh, regular sleeve, the right, basic right side to side. The hand with the sleeve. Because when I do the side, I also pop the arm up high. I try to get that arm up high, right? Okay. And I'm not really trying to throw them to the side. All I'm trying to do is get the weight on your toe. Up, up, this way. So once the weight's on your toe, then it's easy to drop underneath the point. Right. So I do a hard step and I big snap with a hand. Here. So one and sit. Two. Okay. Might be a little, I don't know how many people have mats at home. But we can try it. We'll try it three times. All right. So we do step side and keep your foot up. As soon as your foot's up you're here, you bring it up to your chest and stop. And you're going to hop, sit, and roll. Okay. And you want to sit right on their toes, right in front of their toes. Okay. Ready? And sit. One and sit. Good. Good. Again, ready? So side, block, and hop and sit. Good, chill, sit. Ready? So side, block, and sit. Three, three. Good, last one. Ready? So side, block, and sit. Four. Four. All right. Good job. It'll be much easier to practice this once we get back to the dojo. And we have a partner to throw. It'd be much more fun too. <laughs> All right, you guys got any questions about any of the techniques we did today? Do you have any questions for Sensei Megumi? Grace, you want to un unmute everybody? Hope you guys enjoyed the class today and uh, learned some, some of the new techniques in different directions, okay? So if you have any questions, you can ask Sensei Megumi now. Don't be shy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, no questions? All right then, let's bow up, we'll line up and we'll bow up. Okay, all right, let's go. Good job. <laughs> all right, good job guys, we'll be back. We got a junior class, a women's class on Saturday, and then we have a junior class after that, and then uh, next Tuesday, we'll be back here. And I think Megumi will be doing the whole class. <laughs> All right, good job, guys. Good step. Great. All right. Good job, everyone. Good job. Thank good you. Job, EW, it's good seeing you.
Thank you. Thank you.